I'm on the beaver backside and I'm looking at a fairly large avalanche that was triggered by a snowboarder yesterday. It was remotely triggered from oh, probably 30 feet away from the uh, flank of the avalanche. This one was three, uh, two to three feet deep and about 100 feet wide or so. And it's a pretty hard slab of avalanche, uh, that, that avalanche. Um, it's, I can barely stick my finger in it. And it's sitting on top of, uh, that slab is sitting on top of weak sugary snow, which is pretty classic. It, we're, this, is, this is what we're seeing here. The snow is unstable. There's plenty of collapsing and cracking going on in the backcountry, signs of uh, instability. Stands but the backside is backcountry, and you need to have a partner, a beacon or a transceiver, a probe and a shovel, and make sure you know how to use them and that your partner knows how to use that stuff before you come out here into the backcountry off Beaver Mountain.